Hello everyone, so here we can talk about an application of the mean value theorem. And by the way, this is the last lecture of the course. I'm very, very glad that you've made it this far. Okay, just keep on going to the bonus lecture and I have a surprise for you there. So let's talk about this application of the mean value theorem and it involves speeding tickets. Okay, it may sound strange, but actually it is an application of the mean value theorem. So suppose we have a truck that travels 200 kilometers on a tall road with a speed limit of 80 kilometers per hour. Okay, the truck completes the distance in two hours, but at the end he's issued a speeding ticket. Why is that? Keeping in mind that we know what is the mean value theorem. Okay, so we have a car. It's a very beautiful car. It starts right here. Suppose this point right here, this is A, and it wants to go to point B. Okay, the distance from here to here, this distance is 200 kilometers. Okay, and he makes, so he reaches this point, and he makes this distance in what? Well, in two hours. So from here to here, he makes it in two hours. Okay, and the speeding limit is 80 kilometers per hour. So speed, actually let's do it in red. The speed limit is 80 kilometers per hour. And suppose that, we have a policeman right here. When he enters point A, he is driving in the speed limit. So he's driving 80 kilometers per hour. And when he arrives at point B, also there's a policeman and they check him and the driver is driving at 80 kilometers per hour, but still he's issued a ticket. Why is that? Well, it is due to the mean value theorem, okay? So basically, if he traveled 200 kilometers in two hours, that means he has traveled 100 kilometers in one hour. So his average speed, suppose his average speed is 100 kilometers per hour, okay? And basically, this is the average speed, okay? It is FB minus FA over B minus A. If his average speed is... 100 kilometers per hour, then that means at one point in his travel, his speed has reached 100 kilometers per hour. Okay, that's why they issue him a speeding ticket because they are sure that by using the mean value theorem, since his average speed is 100 kilometers per hour, then at one particular point, his speed has been 100 kilometers per hour and that exceeds the speed limit of the toll road. Okay, so that is the example. We have a car that travels 200 kilometers on a tall road and his travel is continuous. There is no breakage in it and the, his speed changes. That's why it is differentiable. And he makes the travel in two hours, but at the end he is issued a ticket since the speeding limit is 80 kilometers and, he has, and his average speed has been 100 kilometers per hour. Then by the mean value theorem, at one point in his driving from A to B, his speed has been 100 kilometers kilometers and that exceeds the speeding limit okay so that was an application of the mean value theorem and with that we come to the end of the section and end of the course